I'm writing a book right now, and I have three or four books that I'm writing in my head, that's how I write them, <laughs> uh, called I Wish Everybody Was an Immigrant. It's a huge advantage. Being a minority, being an underdog is an advantage. I can't not believe that. Most people come from places that don't have as many opportunities. And like as my dad said, he was like, try being Jewish in Russia after the World War. Mm -hmm. Both my grandfathers spent 10 years in jail Yikes. for being Jewish, straight up. Wow. I have not talked to an immigrant that doesn't have some level of disdain and or disrespect for every American they know. By the way, I think it's so good in America that most people are soft. I'm making this for my son. Xander, I think you're soft. I think a lot of you are not motivated because you're lucky. Yeah. And what I mean by that is you're lucky in different ways. You haven't dealt with the adversity that much. It, it's not a black, white thing, girl, boy thing. Absolutely. It's, you just had great parents, you had a good upbringing. Like life just didn't give you that much adversity. And so, I don't know, you, like I wanna slice throats. Yeah. My mom and dad had absolutely no, uh, <laughs> no tolerance for complaining. There was no opportunity for that. I really appreciate that. I'm, it's funny, I'm visceral to complaining. The quickest tell that somebody's a loser is complaining. Every kid, every girl, every guy, no matter your situation, the one thing you have is time and you can work harder. Maybe mom and dad didn't have a whole lot of talent, didn't pass that much talent to you, and you're meant to be a C player at your max, but guess what? It's better than being a D player, it's better than being an F player, and it's definitely better than being a Z player. There is 87% of the rest of the world where you'd never have this chance. And probably 0% other place where it's so rewarded. I mean, it's so rewarded. Even with all the immigration and geopolitical issues at hand, still in America, if you come from another place, even though you're stealing our jobs and all the cliche stuff, that, the hate and the negativity that people are pushing, still, if you go out and execute and win, America's like, you're a winner. It's really, you know, it's capitalism. Yeah. So, um, yeah, I think it is a humongous advantage.